Bigger crowds and longer lines are beginning to form at the Paranaque Integrated Terminal Exchange with a public set free from pandemic mobility restrictions and with a number of travelers having payback travel in mind. PTV's Rod Lagusad has the skinny in this report. Just over a week until Christmas Day, Jim is already traveling to Batangas City and Oriental Mindoro with some family members to celebrate the holiday season. Usually, yung a week before the holiday, yun talaga yung dagsa ng uh, uwian sa probinsya. Since yung mga tao is dun pa lang matatapos yung trabaho at saka school. He is excited to go home as this is the first in a long time because of the COVID-19 pandemic that he can visit his relatives. Kaya lang ulit ako eh, for three years now. So laging dito ako nag-celebrate uh, ng Christmas sa Manila. While for Tony and his wife, they are going home to Quezon Province. Kami magbiyahin na para hindi masyado masiksikan ang pag-alis namin para maganda ang biyahe. For the expected influx of passengers, the management of Paranaque Integrated Terminal Exchange is already preparing. The average number of passengers in PTEX per day is around 140,000. This figure already exceeded the pre-pandemic figure. And in expect natin sa Christmas week, papalo pa yan ng 160 to 170,000 a day. Kaya naman ito, puspusan ng ating paghahanda no? para siguro doon ng maraming bagay. Unang-una, yung sapat na bilang ng mga pampublikong sasakyan kasi napakamahalaga niyan. Pangalawa, yung seguridad. Seguridad sa loob ng pampublikong sasakyan. Dapat ito yung roadworthy, di ba? Dapat ito yung mga kondisyon na sasakyan lamang at kondisyon din ng mga pampublikong chopper. Because of this, the LTO will conduct roadworthiness tests for buses and random drug tests for drivers. While for the security, the PMP and IAC will be in charge. Salvador added that PTEX already coordinated with DOTR and LTFRB for special permits for buses. And although the restrictions have been relaxed, PTEX reminded the public to follow minimum health protocols. Ang pinaka-big niyan is on the 23rd, that's a Friday, I think. Ano? So, kasi karamihan sa mga pasahero natin, mga daily wage earners yan. So, siyempre, sasamantayin pa nila yung pagkakataon makapaghanap buhay pa this whole week para naman makapagdala sila ng mga kanilang regalo. On December 26, PTEX expects the influx of passengers coming home here in Metro Manila and also in the celebration of New Year the following week. Passengers are advised to purchase tickets earlier to avoid any inconvenience. Rod Lagusad, for the nation.